done deal for one very important Dallas Cowboy. Jaron Curse has signed on with the Cowboys for another term. This is a two-year deal. I'm told it's $5 million a year. There's a chance to make more than that. So this can be two years, $11 million. But let's call it two years, $10 million. And Curse comes back to Dan Quinn's defense here in Frisco. Mike Fisher reporting from Frisco, home of the Dallas Cowboys. Spent the day at the start of day. I poked around on the subject of Curse and Dalton Schultz and more. And we'll have all of that for you. Fish at six live tonight. Uh, the, the issues with Curse in a positive way are many. And we're going to discuss in more depth tonight the fact that in many ways he is now the poster guy for how this is supposed to work. In addition to being a very important cog in the Dallas defense and a surprisingly important cog. This was not the original plan for Curse when they signed him to a one-year deal last year that was basically veterans minimum, uh, $1 million and change. He'd been in the league seven years. He'd been a special teamer. Uh, that's where he made his mark, if he made his mark at all, during his time in Minnesota and during his time in Detroit. But the six foot four safety, who can do so many things athletically, uh, really reinvented himself in Dallas and rediscovered himself. Um, somebody that not only athletic, but somebody that showed a great deal of football IQ and somebody that showed uh, an immense amount of leadership quality, something that it can be argued other teams somehow didn't recognize. Dan Quinn recognized it, and Curse himself showed it off and flexed his muscles, his physical muscles, his intellectual muscles, and all the rest, became a utility guy playmaker and a starter, and now is a key guy for the Cowboys going forward with a new two-year deal worth uh, about $10 million total. We'll have more fish at six tonight on the curse signing and the other thing that it means that's coming up. Stay tuned, fish out.